How's your aunt? Alright y'all, like I'm filming so many videos at one time, but we're just gonna jump right into this video store and my little story time. Let me make sure I got everything right here so I don't have to keep moving. So in this process, I'm about to tell you a story time about how I had a little stalker. It's not a long story time, but it's like a good story time. So I'm guessing y'all would like it. And I'm kind of breaking down because I'm kind of running out of storage and like, I'm taking boom. So I was working at Chick-fil-A and then one day, this guy, he came on my line. Mind you, I thought he was gay. <laughs> I thought he was gay. Like, I'm not even trying to be funny. Like, it was getting gay. Like, it was, he was real zesty. Like, I was just like, oh. So when you trying to talk to me, I was confused. So he was in line. All right, so he wouldn't be getting on my line. So I'm like, oh, I'm smoking some bullshit. Like, all right, man. So then, like, it was giving broke. Because he had to order it right. He ordered, I forgot what he ordered. But he ordered something. I don't know, it was like 12 something. And then he was like, nah, I ain't gonna get it. Can I just get a drink? So then I was like, oh, you like real beautiful. Like, what's your, what's your number and stuff? I was like, oh, um, you know, no, thank you. You know, I'm good. Like, <laughs> I was like, I'm at work, you know what I'm saying? Like, nah, I'm gonna sing so. So then that's when I felt uncomfortable because he was getting mad aggressive once I told him no. He was like, oh, stink ass attitude. Ain't no storage is no joke. So I've never had a guy go off on me like that. So I was kind of surprised. Okay, I had to buy some storage. What the fuck? All right, so back to the story. So like, I was feeling uncomfortable. He was in clothes. Like he was just saying all this weird shit to me. Like he got real upset because I wouldn't get my number. Like now you really not getting my number. Like what the fuck? And you already ugly, like you don't too much. Like, <sighs> so yeah. Yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna have to get yeah. off this and be on these clothes. Yeah. I'm gonna come back once I got that cap on. But more of the story, okay. So then I go in the back and I'm like, okay, this guy in the front, like he's making me feel. I'm going to story time. I'm like, he's making me feel uncomfortable. Can like somebody else bring him up and like, yo, he's drink. So the girl, she come over there to a person. He started cussing me out some more. <sighs> okay. When I put up with my cop, I'm going to come back. Hi. Okay, so let's get right back into the story. So basically, I... But the shit, he's getting cut off. So basically, I did that. So mind you, okay, so boom. He went away, he got his drink, and he went away. Okay, so then, like, I was blown because right after that, like, my big manager, he sent me on break. So, you know, I got my food. I went on break. Like, I'm thinking he's gone. Like, nobody, you know. So, I go to the food car. I'm sitting out chilling. Why? I hear somebody coming up behind me. I'm like, bro, hopefully it's not this nigga, bro. It's this nigga, bro. It was him. So, then he's like, oh, can I enjoy my lunch with you? You know, sit down, talk to the manager. So, I'm like, no, you know, I'm good. Like, I'm going to eat my lunch alone. Like, this nigga could not take rejection for nothing. So then he was like, oh, well, I'm not leaving unless you give me my, your number on your Instagram. So I'm like, I want him to have my Instagram, then my number. You know what I'm saying? Hold on, wait, let me get my edge brush. Okay, I'm back. So yeah, so then he was like, so I gave him my Instagram. Mind you, I follow him on Instagram. I look at the He had a whole girlfriend. So I'm like, hmm. So, and he posted her, like, it was recent. It was a picture of his shoes. And like, yeah. So I'm like, you have a whole girlfriend? He was like, just because I posted girl mean I got a girlfriend. What the fuck? So I'm just trying to get on my favorite stop asking questions. I was like, okay. He was like, you gonna text me? And I was like, yeah. I ain't never text him. I blocked him on Instagram. Boom! I ain't gonna lie, I'm kind of lost. I don't know what I should be doing. I don't know if I should be spraying or putting blue, but I'm gonna spray. Look at that. Okay, so. Spray on my head, not right. You know? Oh, shit. That's how you do it, right, guys? Oh, okay. So, yeah, so then I ain't never texted him back. Hold on, let me just off camera because I don't know how to do this one. Okay, and then, like, I never texted him back. Like, I just left him on red, but then I ended up blocking him because he texted me again. So, why the next? Next day, he came on my job again, but it was late. I had got off really late this night. Yeah, I'm just sorry, my story is too. So, basically, when he came on to my job the next day, but I was leaving this late at night. I had my music blasting like a. Like the you know, just being a fool. So then he sneaks up behind me. I was like, what the fuck? Like I jumped. And he was smiling. He was like, damn, you're not gonna text me back and you're not gonna give me your number still. I was like, oh, oh what the fuck? So I was like, no, nah, like I'm good. Alright, so boy. Like, I'm gonna do it. 
So then he's talking basically, he walks off. So I'm walking like to where the bus stop is, and then like I hear somebody who's running, and this nigga is really running. He's like, hey, hey, stop, come back, I got one more thing to say. Like, real mad aggressive. Mind you, it was late at night, so there was nobody in the mall with me and him. This is what I'm saying, like, what the fuck is she doing that he sat in the mall all that time? And like, you know what I'm saying? So mind you, I'm scared, like, I'm gonna go around to it, and like, yeah, but I didn't stop, I had gone. So then he like blocks me in like the door thing. And he like, you too good to give me a number and shit. Like, what is going on? I'm like, oh, I'm about to die. Let me see some shit. So I still ain't even remember. I was like, I don't know, you know. Then I was like, I got a boyfriend. You know, and I remember, like, you know, I don't know what that is. Because he was not fucking out. Okay, so I'm going. So he like, he definitely won't think that's when I was like, I got a boyfriend. So he was not about to let me go. And he's like, I don't know why the fuck you should be like, I don't know why the fuck you should be like, Definitely cool, I was on way, take a car, take a plane, baby, whichever is fancy Whichever one is in the house, oh, yeah, yeah, uh, never knew, no, I never knew That you be a freak and a friend, too, yeah, you into everything I'm into, oh, I got something that I could lend you, oh, a piece of mind, baby, come and get a piece of mind, yeah Say you gotta work from three to nine, oh, I get you home by a decent time Wait, fuck your bed, you can sleep in mine. Yeah, let's make it happen, girl. I need some time. Speaking of time, who stopped it? That's the feeling that I get when we lock lips. I got the weed at the crib and the liquor too. I fuck your soul, I release in your spiritual. I be your muse, bring your easel and pencil suit. Here you go, you try and tease with them pictures. You could ride on me just like you ride the elliptical. She said, I'm trying to keep it tight for my nigga. Girl, I like your last nigga. All I need is mental. You know, I'll work you out, get you right with your physical. Always just another interlude. Asking all the questions, girl, you know I don't do interviews. It's pitiful that when I'm with them other bitches, I pretend it's you. Oh, you work at Coles, you in dental school. Wife and now you from the clothes, cooking dinner too. Young Tiller, girl, I'm known as Pen Griffey too. It's only right that I swing by and hit it too. First base, second base, third base. I'm trying to get you in your birthday too. Oh, I know these other niggas thirsty, but please never entertain them, cause that will hurt me, you feel me? Yeah. Okay, let me hear I know you feel me. This is the end of the